Hi, I'm Lisa Shabiris, Marketing Manager at Brad Teal. I'm here with Phil Martins, CFO and Director of the Live for Lily Foundation, who we support via the Brad Teal Community Connect program. Phil, tell us about the Live for Lily Foundation. The foundation was established in 2016 in memory of Lily Hester, a local girl who passed away from a rare liver cancer in 2014. Our mission is solely to find a cure for childhood cancer, and we do that by running two main events every year, the Butterfly Ball and the Ride for Lily charity cycling event. We just came back from Tasmania, it was our fourth Ride for Lily event, um, having started that in 2016. Now we had 28 riders down in Tasmania who cycled a thousand kilometres in seven days and raised over $260,000 uh, for children's cancer research. Phenomenal effort. And the Pink Jersey Award? Yes, this year we introduced a new award in memory of Lily's mother, Cyan, who unfortunately and sadly passed away from her own breast cancer two years after Lily in 2016. Uh, the, the Cyan Hester Inspiration Award, which is proudly sponsored by uh, Brad Teal, um, was launched this year to help create more awareness for what we're doing and also uh, encourage our riders to raise as much money as possible on the ride for Lily. So every rider has to raise a minimum of $5,000 to come on the ride and the rider who raises the most money gets to wear the, you know, uh, the pink jersey and that happened to be a, a gentleman this year who raised 55000 over $55,000. Mm. Yeah, phenomenal. Uh, the Butterfly Ball coming up shortly in a few weeks. Yes, we've got the Butterfly Ball coming up on the 15th of June at Crown Palladium. Uh, that's also started in 2016. Uh, we started it um, really with just a bunch of volunteers. We got 400 people at the first event this year. We've got a record number of over 700 people attending Crown Palladium. All our money that we raise from our events is going towards the Children's Cancer Institute in Sydney and their Zero Childhood Cancer Program. And that's a personalised medicine program that they've established in the last three years where every child at risk of uh, serious cancer can have the opportunity to have their uh, in individual cancer cells tested uh, for the best treatment course available for them. Phil, how can the community get involved in future events and support the Foundation? Yes, Lisa, there's a number of ways that uh, people and businesses can get involved with the Foundation um, through running their own uh, events during the, the year, like uh, sausage sizzles or morning teas, movie nights, trivia nights, those sorts of things. Um, we also have uh, opportunities through the website for, for donations to come through, either supporting riders individually on the Ride for Lily or just general donations. We have a, a reoccurring donation set up there that people can donate via. Um, also, businesses can support us by uh, donating live and silent auction items for our Butterfly Ball, which is held every year in June. Um, and we have broader, more um, bigger sponsorship packages available for family and friends of the, the ride and the, the foundation to get involved and to really help with their community and um, uh, community support through their own workplace and get their employees involved. Okay, so plenty of opportunity to show support and get involved. And the website? Uh, the website is www.liveforlily.org.au. Great. Thanks for your time, Phil. No worries. Thank you very much.